gnarly. No, no it wouldn't. On. Yeah, it wouldn't hook on. That's that's the difference. Is that it wouldn't hook on to the pole like it does the the stand. You know, like clicked in. But if we got the adapter. I think thirty-five dollars is worth it if it's gonna be secure. I'm sorry, you have to do that, Mace. You need a new needle. I changed it yesterday before I went to bed. You should change it every day. No, before I went to bed. Okay, that's probably enough. I don't. You think? It's been a rough couple of mornings because kids have to have their medicine early and we don't want to get up early, but we do and we give them meds and then they're rotten for the first hour. Love the screen door, glass door more than anything because I'm going to show you. I'm going to walk backwards. First of all, I can't breathe when there's clutter. It gives me panic attacks and so every morning I have to clean and get everything organized as much as possible so that I can all four kids in here doing four different things and happy as can be. We just threw the PS4 back. We found a place to store the mattresses during the day. So Bella and Mace, Ammon are playing on the computer. Mason's playing Dungeons and Dragons, his new favorite game, right? Tell me how much you love it. It's not a new favorite game, but I really love playing. You re you rediscovered it. Bella likes it now. They went to the library last night with Daddy and played Dungeons and Dragons all night. The library is awesome when you live in a trailer. Hunter's playing PS4. Let's see if I can get it on the TV up there. They all bought their dice yesterday. Bella's glow in the dark. And Daddy's working back in the bedroom. I'll show you how. Everything's melting. It's gonna be up to 55 today. Daddy is working hard. I'm scanning in all of our tax stuff, is that right? Yeah. Trying to get our taxes done since we didn't drive home. We're gonna scan it all and send it to our tax guy. I'm really having a hard time getting used to these new glasses. I took the kids to the library so I could get some studying in. I really wanna take my EMT boards in a month. I've had to give up on my OEC outdoor emergency care course because I got so sick I missed way too much. So I'll have to take that next season. But I am studying for my NR EMT boards, which is very expensive to take. So I'm a little bit sad today. I woke up feeling completely fine, got to church, enjoyed it, helped the little kids sing, even though we did a bad job, but about 30 minutes after I got home, I started struggling. I started getting super dizzy and sick, and I haven't felt right since, and I took a shower, and I, I just had a handful of hair that fell out of my head. This is why lupus sucks, I never know when it's gonna hit or how it's gonna hit. I'm hoping this is just a short-term thing, but the fact that I had a fistful of hair makes me so sad because last year, all of my hair fell out and I've been growing this crap that doesn't look very good for over a year, about a year. Cause we had to shave my head last year cause I just had chunks coming out. I don't wanna go through that again. I don't wanna be bald again. I've worked so hard to grow hair, even though it's thin. I mean, like, I have no eyebrows. It's just, I don't want to go through that again. I hope it stops. These help us to make the right choices and have the spirit to lead and guide.